Hey y'all, can't very well see very good. So today's gonna be a different type of vlog. Um, I'm out here in my happy place at the back of my property. I'll show you a little bit of it. It's not very pretty looking, but to me it's quiet back here. All you hear are the animals and the stream is back here, which in the summertime, in this hot, hot Florida weather, is really nice because it's always cold. But when I have thinking to do and want to be alone, this is where I come. And of course, we need to do a lot of cleaning up after the hurricane still because trees came down over the stream. But I just wanted to talk a little bit and let y'all know what's going on about the fall over. So while I talk, I'm going to turn you around and let you watch this pretty stream flowing. So give me one second to turn you around. Isn't that pretty? The sun shining across parts of it. So yeah, I'll just come and sit out here and put my feet in the water and listen to the quietness of the stream and the animals. But anyway, some of you know that my husband and the kids and I have had a pretty hard life so far up until about a year ago. And we just bought our property a year ago this month and actually it'll be a year here in a few days and life was wonderful we were finally happy we were finally in our own place we got our animals and more animals well all that's about to change um, not the house or the animals but we're going to have my in-laws moving on our property they bought an rv and they will be here either wednesday or thursday at the latest of this week today is december 11th so in just a few days they'll be here and they'll be living on our property I'm not saying that's a bad thing at all um there's been tension in the family before and i'm worried about that um, but they're coming down so that they can bond with our boys. Um, Trey will be 18 in March. John will be 15 in February. And RJ will be 14 in January. And they've never bonded with them because they've lived in Louisiana. And we've either been here in Florida or when my husband was on shore duty in Virginia. So it's going to take a lot of adjusting on our part and I'm worried about that um, I have to learn to let go of some chores and some stuff you guys know I love to cook and I'm gonna have to relinquish some of that and let them help with the cooking and the baking and stuff like that and that's going to be hard for me and I know I pray it doesn't but I know until I can adjust that it's going to cause issues and I've got to just bite my tongue and that's hard for me to do as well um, they will be in their own RV um, but they'll be spending, you know, all day in with us. So my question is, what do you guys do when you get stressed and need alone time? Where's your happy place? Do you go to it often? This is my happy place. And I can see me coming out here a lot. 